Hey guys, what's up? It's Fire Panda back with another FIFA Mobile video. In this one, we will be reviewing this guy. I think his name is Lei Melu. Tell me if I'm pronouncing it wrong. So, this guy's an idiot overall. And uh, basically, I had to put my Mbappe back in the squad to get him to fit chemistry wise. So, that's why you're seeing Mbappe again. This guy seems pretty decent. Like, he has 83 pace, 85 shooting. 96 passing, 90 dribbling, 80 defending, and 81 physical. So he has actually holiking, which is pretty sick. And so let's try him out in some versus attack. Okay, we're going against a decent team. He has a Nabby Keita. Wait, does this guy not have chemistry unlocked? Huh. This guy doesn't even have chemistry. Uh, oh no, he does. He does. I'm an idiot. Um, okay. Let's see what we can do here. This guy's going to be a tough opponent, I can guarantee it. Even if he's a little worse than me on paper, he's still good. Oh, free kick? Come on. Ah, Tammy Abraham's so tall, it's hard to get over him. Brooks? Nope, I got scored on. Of course I did. Oh, perfect chance. Mbappe, brilliant goal. Alessandrini? Bangs it in. Perfect. Ugh, I wish in these versus attack it would give my center mids more of a shot. Alessandrini, there we go. So, like, where is he? Like, do I have to wait for him to come off the field or something? Where is he? Oh, he's way back there. Come on. Do I have to play this guy at, like, cam or something? I mean, I don't want to do that, but if I have to, I have to. I'd always be open to it, I guess. Oh! Okay, that was a good shot. And right top corner, David Beckham. Yes. For some reason, my David Beckham likes to push up in versus attack, but, uh, Le Malude does not and it's a little annoying uh i think i'll just try like a normal game maybe see how that works out uh so i guess i could do a seasons match i mean i'm not sure how long these actually are they're probably like 10 minutes it's against a 63 overall team because i don't play this mode it's just not very rewarding once you've unlocked, like, transfer mark and stuff. So it's kind of a waste of time. But I think this will be a good way to try him out. Um. Okay. I'm gonna try to play him more as an attacking option than a defensive option. If possible. Where is he? Ooh, he is a very defensive player, though, I can tell from, like, his work rates. He's staying back near my center backs rather than pushing up. What skill move does this guy have? Does this guy have a special skill move, guys? Oh, that's a skill move. I like that skill move. I do like him. He was able to skill through this entire team. Yeah, that's a decent skill move. Uh, it's the same one my um, Alessandrini has, and I do quite like it, so... Passes that test. I just wish he would be a little more attacking, because he is very good. He has good dribbling, shooting, and he doesn't have great defending, so I don't know why he's so defensive. Uh, yeah, that's a really cool skill move there. Uh, unfortunately, he missed that shot, but he was able to push up the field really, really nicely there. So, that's pretty nice. Giannoulis, uh, I can't get that back. Give it to him. Okay, now I'm just gonna run it off with him. He has 83 pace, which isn't the best. He's, like, a few pace slower than my Meatstro, unfortunately. But 
I think he's fast enough for a center mid, you know? Calvert Lewin able to clean up that rebound. I do like this uh this card. He's very good tri has very good dribbling. He seems to do his skill moves at like the perfect time. I really want to test out that passing though. Oh yeah, that's a perfect ball through. So this guy's uh if you can try to play him as more of a forward pushing playmaker. Because he's good on the ball, and he has, makes really good uh, passes. But don't try to shoot with him unless necessary. He's kind of like a David Beckham, but a tiny bit better, I'd say. Because obviously David Beckham just isn't the best card in this game. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna give it back to him. For some reason, my left back is much more attacking than him, and I don't really get why. I wish there was, like, a formation change kind of thing, you know? But I don't think there is. Okay, let's see it. Not... Okay, I probably shouldn't have tried that there. Oh, he actually got the foul drawn, though, for that. That's pretty good. Uh, I don't know what Mbappe was doing for that run. He just kind of ran off to nowhere after I uh, positioned it. But, whatever. <sighs> yeah, everyone feels bad as, like, um, a center mid in comparison to this card. Like, he is a very good center mid. And I will And I, I mean, I'll be fine going back to my meets Joe and stuff. Uh, but this card is really, really good. So if you guys just don't have that kind of player, like, um, uh, like a center mid who can control it, like, if maybe, I don't know, you weren't able to get that, uh, Beckham, because he is a little hard to get, I know. You should pick this guy up, because he's a very similar player to Beckham. He's just more of a defensive player than an attacking player, from what I can tell. I think this is Calvert-Lewin on the attack, yep. Okay. Cross it in, Mbappe. Brilliant goal. I'm glad that uh, in these seasons modes, I get to try out some more non-attacking players, which I really, really like. Um, so if, if you guys want me to play more of these seasons games than uh, versus attack, let me know. And I will be happy to do so. Because I think this is actually a pretty good review format we've got going. Calvert on the attack. Yes. Chip it. Yes. No! How did I miss? Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Okay. Um... Okay, Alessandrini is on it now. Where is, uh, Le... Oh, there he is. Le Malou. That's what I'm gonna call him. Ooh. Good attempt at a shot. He has pretty good shot power, I think. Uh, after this, I will give you guys the final verdict on this card, though. David Beckham with a last-minute finisher. And that's the game. Okay. So, I got some season points and stuff, and yeah. Let's, uh, let's check it out. Okay, so, this guy... Pace is a 7 out of 10. Shooting, 8 out of 10. Passing, 10 out of 10. Dribbling, 10 out of 10. Defense, 7 out of 10. And physical, 8 out of 10. That's my verdict on him. He's around the same as meets Joe, in my opinion. He's just slower. It's the only issue. They have, like, fairly similar stats, I'd say. He's just a little slower. So, yeah, I'd use this card... I wouldn't mind using this card. I mean, I think he's more of a 
certain type of play style. Like, if you like having that guy who can just pass through to your wingers, I think you would love this card. But if you're looking for a more attacking player, get Meatstro. So anyways, guys, that's all, and I'll see you guys next time.